Hey, fam. Thank y'all so much for being here with me. Two minutes happening. in. Y'all already know who and what it is. So let's just go and tap in with spirit. Get these timely general messages for you guys. Y'all, I know it's been a struggle on the channel. The messages haven't been coming, you know, as consistently. They're very sporadic. I'm doing my best with all the interruption that I've been getting. I am doing my absolute best. I promise y'all. So y'all just continue to support your girl. Send me love and healing energy because I'm always sending it to y'all no matter where y'all are in this crazy ass world. But I do thank all of y'all for y'all love and support, man. It is just like, it's overwhelming. Thank everyone who booked the personal, who sent uh, tips and donations, things like that. I appreciate y'all from the bottom of my heart. And I promise you, it's energy, so it will be returned to you tenfold. Thank y'all so, so much. Like, it's overwhelming. Y'all, the other day I had a reading, right? Y'all know I do my readings, um like video chat i like to connect with you i'm not the one who's gonna do a reading and send you an email with you know i want to connect with you because it helps me tap into your energy more yeah i was like so i was just like oh my god i was overwhelmed because the uh the one who booked the person she was like oh my god i'm on the phone with bucky bucky oh my god i'm on the phone with a famous person yeah i am not famous by any means i don't feel that way at all it's just me simply sitting here, either I'm on um, in front of my camera talking to y'all, or I'm on live. But either way it go, it's just me and y'all, and we fam. Ain't no fame, ain't no nothing like that. So, yeah, I'm just, shit, I ain't no different from y'all. I just read tarot, I get messages from spirit. That's the only thing. But see, a lot of y'all are intuitive y'all self. But I just thought I would share that with y'all, because that just, like, it was, like, so funny to me. She was, like, really flabbergasted, y'all. It was so cute. Uh, she always watch my channel, so shout out to my love, my sis. <laughs> you are absolutely amazing. All right, y'all, but let's go ahead. I done babbled and talked enough, y'all. But um, let's just go on and get into it. I have to tell y'all, y'all know the music that y'all hear in the background. I own no rights to. Of course, y'all know the hell. I ain't no damn songwriter. I'm trying to stop cursing. I really, really am. Y'all work with me. Your girl is so, 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 so trying. I promise you. Okay, y'all, anything y'all need to know about myself and my channel will be in the description box below. Check it out. Also, y'all already know the messages are timeless as well as general. So take what resonates, leave what does not. And when you come across this message, today is, um, I think it's October the 3rd, I mean, October, Jesus. November 13th, 2022. But whenever you come across the message, fam, that's when uh, Spirit has it for you. But yeah, we finna get into this because this it's a karmic, y'all have karmic energies all around y'all. Not one, it's a few. I'm hearing five. Some of y'all have five karmic energies around you. Yep, look, we got the five of ones right there. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, but see, these are people, they got a lot to say about you, fam, but they'll never say it to your face. Some of y'all, this information is about to reach out. Yep, it's about to reach out. Mm hmm the judgment. Whatever it is that was said... Some of y'all, this is going to be like word of mouth. Others of y'all, you're going to notice somebody shooting slugs at you on uh, social media. Mm -hmm. These people are jealous. They don't have nothing better to do. Yeah. They talking about your money, your commitment. Somebody talking about your clothes. Yeah. Somebody got a lot to say about somebody's kids as well, Spirit is saying. You got to leave the kids out of whomever you are. Yeah, because that five of cups, you're going to end that regret talking uh, about somebody's kids. Yeah, because they're going to come and beat your ass. Because <laughs> this information is going to get back to somebody, whomever you are, that this video about to resonate with. Yeah. Shit, this could even be um, somebody kid bringing this information to somebody. See, that's why y'all never speak on nobody. I don't understand why adults evolve, involve children in a in crap. If you got a problem with another adult, you you should not be speaking on that adult in front of no child. Yeah, it could be an Aries here. It don't have to be, but this could have something to do with the masculine. Somebody is really, really butthurt behind a damn masculine. Yep, Emperor and the King of Cups. <laughs> Somebody butthurt behind a masculine that got feelings for you. This person wants you. Yeah, they rather deal with you and all your BS, fam, over this other person. Mm -hmm. well, let's get into this karmic energy because they got a lot to say <laughs> yeah look some of y'all got these people blocked on social media or something like that somehow this person still accesses your page 
you gonna have to stand up to somebody coming up here soon, fam. Somebody is really getting ready to challenge you. Yeah, this could be somebody, baby mama. Yeah, Aries, Sagittarius. This is all because this person is dealing with you and not them. Yeah, somebody here with this uh, Seven of Wands and this Empress. Somebody, either you or this person, finna have to stand up to their child's mother or father here. Hmm. I also feel like this karmic energy is finna try your person, especially if they got kids together. It's some kind of uh, communication that's going to be sent. I it's possibly over like social media or text message or something like that. Yeah, the king and the queen of pentacles. This person, baby mama or baby daddy is going to send them. I'm hearing illicit text message or some type of picture here. They are they trying to lure this person back in. See, what it is, this person is trying to block y'all's union. They see that this baby mama or baby daddy is offering to you and really not paying them no mind. It's like this person waiting for the exact right time to come towards your person. Hmm. Yeah, look, meeting. I'm telling y'all, uh, uh, Fujiano, Lotto, and Gucci, shouts. Somebody here is going to try to lure your person in uh, sexually. Mm -hmm. so yeah that's something y'all should be mindful of when it comes to this karmic energy yeah this person right here they watch you in this masculine i'm telling you they watching they trying to take this person's focus off of you yeah i ain't gonna lie though it's like some of y'all people or y'all person they fighting this temptation with their past person with this baby mama or ex-girlfriend, whomever she may be, ex-wife. They fighting a the temptation with this person. Somebody here could be a Leo. Yeah. But we got the Ten of Swords here. Y'all watch out for that. Because somebody is going to try to tempt your person. And somebody person is going to go for it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's a Leo here because I got the sun and then I got the strength. So I don't know if you are a Leo or the person is a Leo or somebody got this highly aspected in a chart. But your person is going to have to exude an extreme amount of strength because I already see them like teeter-totter. It's like they tempted. Mm -hmm. Somebody just told you now watch them work. So this person got some up their sleeve. This karmic energy got some up their sleeve. Yeah, some of them could be a cancer, but somebody determined her to come back towards your person. And that's the truth. Do you understand? Somebody here is determined to get your person to come to them, uh, sleep with them, uh, lie to you. Something here ain't right. So let's get into it. Holy Spirit, one more shuffle. Yeah, look, the five of swords, jealousy, gossip, mind games. I'm telling you, this person feels intimidated by you. Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgos. <laughs> Somebody here could even be pregnant right now or something like that. Somebody here is trying to stop you from getting pregnant. Baby, you can't make this up. Somebody out here coming, they coming for your person because they, they don't want you to have a child by this person. They want you gone from the picture, baby. Yeah. Pfft. They want this. They want to block your new beginning with this person so they can have one themselves. This karmic energy tripping. But let's go on again. <laughs> baby, because I could cut these cards and read all damn day. Yeah, baby, there you go again, Leo. This card is speaking to me. Yeah, you know what the funny thing is about this karmic, you know, usually karmic energies, they're not people that's just like, they're like um, ratchet. I'm not getting this from this person. This person here is a very good mother. They're they're single at this time, a very good mother. They make their own money. This is a very strong individual, but for some reason, yeah, look, no, she don't want this situation between you and this person balanced out. Could be a Libra here. Yeah. Shh. 
Shoot. Yeah, I see, man. And this woman, she... Yeah, somebody here could be pregnant. Mm -hmm. Holy Spirit. Give me one on this card. Ten of Swords pop right out. Ten of motherfucking Swords. The over <laughs> Ten of Swords. You say she trying to... She's trying to end this situation one way or another. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Yeah, four of cups. Mm -hmm. She finna start trying to offer to your person. And she's not going to stop. She is determined to take his focus off of you or her focus off of you. Yeah, the judgment. And then the ten of wands. She's finna try to make this person feel guilty. That's what I'm getting from this. She's finna try to make this person feel guilty. About not being with her, not raising these kids or something like that. Uh, leaving the home. I don't know what this is, but she's trying. She's going to try to make this person feel very, very guilty. Yeah, Hermit card could be a Virgo here. Aquarius energy as well. Yeah, it's like she, <laughs> baby, this is crazy. She want him to leave you alone. It's like something that she, yeah, Aquarius energy. It's something that she's saying to this person or about to say that's going to kind of put him in his head, have him reevaluating that situation with her. Like, is this the right thing to do? Things like this. <laughs> Yeah, I'm feeling like this woman is very, this, well, this karmic. I can't say woman because it's just the energy, male or female. This person is very spiritual themselves. Yeah, two of cups. I'm telling you. <laughs> y'all, don't be surprised if this person start lying on y'all as well. I'm telling you, you can't make it up. Then we got the nine of uh, swords, the three of wands, and then the world card. It's something that somebody is going to say to your person about you. This is a karmic energy. It is going to have this person stuck in their head. So if this person start acting distant towards you, this is why. Yeah. Somebody is going to even bring up this situation with, you know, the kids and stuff to make somebody feel guilty. So if your person start acting distant, that is why. They got a lot on their mind at this time. A lot. This karmic energy don't give a damn about nothing but what she or he wants. Yeah, fix on energy. Aquarius, Scorpio, Taurus, or Leo. Oh my goodness. Somebody here is bringing up Christmas. It's like, you don't never spend Christmas with us. You can at least spend Christmas night or Christmas Eve night or something like that. That's when they going to make their move on this person. Because it's like they've already like subtly been uh, offering. But I feel like your person has just been like turning them down, but they are tempted. Yeah, they've been turning them down. This person, if they have a family, you can't make this shit up. <laughs> They've been turning them down. It's like somebody won't, they don't express that they want somebody to come back. You know, we have a family together. You know, we got to make this work shit like this. This person has been turning them down and kept walking away. But I'm saying somebody finna try to make somebody feel guilty about leaving their family. Libra Taurus energy. I'm hearing this is something that we built. Yeah. I hear somebody want to leave and somebody like, we, why? You know, we've been together too long in order for you. This karmic energy in your person has had a relationship for a very long time. So this is not somebody that's new in the picture. Whomever I'm speaking to. Yeah, this person... You can't make it up four pinnacles and a ten of pinnacles. This somebody your, your person got a family with. They holding on to this person. They try to make it seem like they not, but they are. Mm -hmm. 
Somebody watches you and your person. You see how this is like outside of a home? So I don't know if this person watching you outside of their home. They're watching you outside of your home. Shit, you could be outside the masculine home for all I know. But I do know that it's a child right here. So this is what I'm telling y'all. Y'all masculine is being tempted by his baby mama or her baby daddy. There go the baby right there. This person is flirting with your person. Hold on, y'all. Okay, y'all. Sorry about that. But yeah, like I was saying, this is somebody your, your person got a family with. This person holding on to your person. So, yo, this karmic energy, if they already have a baby together, this karmic energy might want to have another child. If you are, oh, if you are this, okay, so wait a minute. If you are the one on the other side of this and you have children with a person that is with somebody else and you know this person has issues with you for whatever reason, this person is encouraging your baby mama or baby daddy or something like that to just leave it all behind. The, you, the kids, everything. Yeah, somebody here is like, they waiting and waiting, but they getting ready to walk away. If, yo, if somebody don't, <laughs> this is crazy. This is if you know that your baby daddy or your baby mama dealing with somebody else. Somebody here is like, if you don't leave this person alone, they want this person to leave their family. Wow. This could even be like for financial reasons. This just got weird as fuck. It feel like somebody torn between you and somebody else. Y'all gonna have to pick what side of this y'all on. Mm -hmm. Lord have mercy. All right, yes, yeah, a Leo here. Somebody feel like yo masculine is putty in their hands, like they can handle this man whenever they want to. Or this woman, y'all gotta. Oh, is there any more on this karmic energy? Yeah, it could be a Scorpio here. Yeah. Oh shit! The devil and death card come flying out together. It really feel like here this. This karmic energy has an obsession. With your, you, with your, you, your kids, your, your entire family that you built with this masculine. This person got a real obsession with y'all. Y'all be careful because this person is spiritual. And with this death card and the devil, this person could easily be trying to put magic on everybody that live in your house. Wow. Yeah, this person is doing separation spells and everything. It's like, look, 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 y'all. If you've been with your masculine and things keep going up and down, up and down, Aquarius energy. Keep getting Leo energy. We got Capricorn, Scorpio, um, Aries, Virgo. If things are going Libra Taurus, if anything's going like up and down, up and down, it is because somebody done put magic on your whole entire house. Somebody see that this masculine is changing or trying to at least change some type of toxic behavior or some type of addiction for you. Because honestly, you make this person very happy. Oh, and we got the Ace of Swords on them. I didn't even see that. Yeah, this is, some, this is somebody's story. Somebody need to hear this. But somebody is trying to end whatever this connection is that you have with your masculine. This karmic energy is determined to end this. She's like obsessed, I'm telling you. And this magic that she doing, she just keep doing it and doing it and doing it. But it keep backfiring. It seems like the more she do this shit, it's like the more she try to pull y'all apart, the more he wants to separate from her. But he kind of like, it feel like he got a, he can't quite just like separate because it's all this magic being done. Ooh. 
Somebody is just like sitting and waiting for the day that they can actually get away from this, this energy, this karmic energy. And this person knows that. It's like they hold it on so tight. Something has to do with finances. Holy Spirit. Who is this karmic energy? Knight of Wands. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Again, somebody here is only worried about money. Don't that look like a dollar sign? I'm hearing somebody could be asking somebody to move out their house. Yeah, because it's like they don't feel like they can trust this person or this person ain't for them anymore. This karmic energy is doing everything they can, can do to stay attached to your person. Yeah, oh shit. I knew it. Three of could No, it came out upright, y'all. I laid it down that way. But it came out like this, right? It came out upright. But it's when I laid it down, it went like this. So this could be possibly one of your person's friends. Yeah, this person don't want to show their face, though. Your person is waking up to who this friend is. And it's like they trying to decide whether or not, you know, do they want to stay in this friendship or they don't. But with that three of cups in the reverse, I feel like this person, they don't feel like this person has their best intentions at heart. Yeah, look, we got the seven of cups. And then we got the seven of pentacles, seven, seven. Somebody here is here because of what they can get from another person. This karmic energy don't want your person to give nothing to you so they can give everything to them. Page of Pentacles, you can't make this up. Could be an earth sign or Capricorn towards Virgo. Somebody here is uh, confused. It's like this karmic is doing confusion spells. Like, this is crazy. This karmic energy is... Why are they doing this? Exactly. Temperance, Sagittarius energy. Hmm. Holy Spirit, why is the temperance just on flu out here? I feel like Spirit telling somebody to be patient, like stay calm, be patient. Don't react. Spirit is saying don't react. Somebody watching y'all in the shadows too. It's like this person could be doing a million other things, but they sitting there watching you. Cancer energy, the cherry and the ace of wands. I'm telling you. Somebody is determined for your, to get your person back. They like patiently waiting on something. It could be for this magic to work. But I don't feel like it's working. I feel like it's going back. It's a lot. The Queen of Cups and then something else flipped. The Two of Pentacles. I'm telling y'all, somebody trying to get pregnant by your person. Also, this person causing confusion spells. They got your person confused as to if you really love them or not. So this karmic energy is doing a lot to harm y'all's relationship. But I want y'all to know with that judgment, the temperance, and uh, hierophant, spirit is looking over this to a cup situation. So healing energy will be brought back in. It might take a little bit of time, y'all, because this person is relentless in doing this. It's like once, once something don't work, they cook up something else. So, yeah, somebody could be gossiping, like putting stuff in your person's ear about you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's magic being done here, y'all. The magician finally showed up. I was waiting on him. There's magic being done on your person, you, as well as your children. So, it is very important for y'all to cleanse your energy. Send this shit back. Send it back. If you don't want to send it back, ask the uh, the Most High Heavenly Father God to take it, transmute it into love, and spread it across the nation. I got that from one of my subscribers. Thank you so much, sis. Because there is serious magic being done here. Spirit is saying against someone's fertility as well, so y'all might want to take that into consideration if you're trying to have a baby. Yeah, there's a Gemini here. Possibly with the lover's card and the magician. This I don't know what side this person is on. King of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody trying to call they ma this masculine back into them. Yep, somebody got kids with this person. This is somebody ex. And if you don't have children with this person, 
you've known this person for a very long time. This this relationship in the beginning it felt kind of innocent. This this karmic refused to be left out in the cold. Somebody here might have to move out of someone's home. And that is why they doing it. It's like they can't. They don't they they done got so comfortable. Yeah, you see how you on the outside of their home? Somebody here drink way too much. Way too much. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they watching. See now this person hold on, y'all. Yeah, but who somebody is watching this person. It's like they watching this person now. The letter F could be very, very significant. Somebody don't trust somebody that's in their home, possibly, is what I'm feeling. Yeah, there's a Taurus here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. See, the thing is, somebody here want, want a commitment from somebody. So this could be a female. This could be one of these person friends. It's just all kind of shit. Somebody want to be tied to somebody possibly for financial reasons. And so I feel like this, this karmic is relentless in trying to separate y'all once and for all, fam. Yeah, they working hard. Somebody here looks things up. They look shit up. Yeah, it could be a Pisces. Don't have to be, though. Yeah, but they trying to block out this year. They don't want your person to be with you at all, fam. Yeah, tower. Mm -mm. well fam we gonna leave it right there if it resonated please um like the video subscribe to the channel if you haven't already fam if you do subscribe hit that notification bell so you can be notified whenever i do upload i love y'all so much i pray y'all have a beautiful ending to y'all's day fam and we will get back up